bridge raises, you can see how it works. There are two big blocks of concrete over on our left and on our right. They are moving in the opposite direction of that lifting span. So those blocks go down, lifting span goes up, or vice versa, blocks go up and lifting span goes down. As we're going under the bridge, feel free to wave to the bridge operator. He's sitting in that operator's house that's that tiny little house in the middle of the bridge. He is up there for 12 hours at a time, so it does get kind of lonely, so feel free to wave. He's got windows on all sides. He can see you very well, especially if you're outside. But again, that is the person that raises it up and down, so we do have to be nice to him. Now, this kind of lifting mechanism is actually really precise because when they repaint the bridge, weight has to be added to each of those blocks. So say you needed like 80 gallons of paint, you would need 40 on each of those blocks as well to kind of balance out that new weight of the paint. The Duluth Area Lift Bridge was constructed in 1905 and it converted into turn for busy summer months. And after 3,000 feet, those cross the bridge on a summer day. Now, a couple of boat turns as we're kind of passing through our canal here. Every, to our left is port, to our right is smoke.
north side of the canal, there's a bar, kind of a second level seating outside that building right there. Last one, it's like all the way. <laughs> 